um, Saturday evening and the team have been called out to help with an injury to a casualty on the Kinderlow Steps area of Kinder. Two hill parties are already out and we have a rescue helicopter inbound because we're thoroughly expecting significant injury to this casualty, possibility of a back injury. The two teams that are already out have taken a stretcher and immobilisation gear where the third party up and we have additional equipment and drugs with us four extra pairs of hands in case we're needed <coughs> you can also see the casualty on the steps at Kinderlow had a fairly brisk yomp up to the Kinderlow steps and you can see the casualty party up ahead in the rocks. The helicopter hasn't arrived yet so we'll go in and see if we can assist the casualty parties that are already on scene. Yeah, brief him on the way in. Pull socks with me, I just haven't got it on him yet. So. Cool. Now you're not shaking, Kyle. Can you try and wiggle your feet? Even though the casualties already had fentanyl, he's still complaining of extreme pain around his back and hips. So Ollie prepares to give him some additional IV morphine. The pilot tells us that the wind conditions aren't going to allow him to hold a hover over our location. So it looks like a winch is out. He asks if we can carry this casualty to the top of Kinderlow. So to do that, we need to put up a backup line in place just to make sure that if somebody slips, the casualty goes nowhere while we're carrying them up the steps. So we're going to have to do a reset, so we'll, we'll run up to there, hold, run the rope up and go again from there. So I reckon that the three Highline people will do our body belay. Right. Yeah. Because we're all rigged with proper gloves. Because you've all got the gloves on. Yeah. So I think I think a three person body belay will be fine because you're well braced on that rock. Yeah. Are you comfortable with... And we're only backing up for a slip. We're only backing up for a slip. We're not yeah. holding. Yeah. We're carrying. So that, they'll be the, the lifting party will be the stretching party. Yeah. Um, you three will be oh, let's go let's go back
helicopter has now gone to take him to uh, Northern General in Sheffield. Uh, Dale, who was our guy who was doing the medical initial medical treatment, the casualty care work, um, he's gone with them. Uh, because That's mainly because we've given them uh, fentanyl, which is a drug that they don't carry. So they want us to go along to monitor the use of that drug. Um, so Dale's gone to Sheffield. We're all heading down now to take the kit back to our Land Rovers, which are somewhere down in the distance. Um, and then I think we'll have to send one of them round to Sheffield to go and get Dale back. Uh, so he won't get home till late, late tonight. Okay.